Kevin Hart filed a lawsuit against Tasha Kay in December, claiming that the gossip blogger extorted money from him. She recently plunked down with his ex-right hand, Misha Shakes, for a dooming interview. Welcome viewers to my channel, please subscribe, like my video and turn on notifications so you don't miss our next update. Shakes alleged that Hart had a gambling problem, cheated on his wife, and more during the interview. As per him, Tasha Kay and her group supposedly later took steps to deliver the full meeting on the off chance that he didn't pay her $250,000. Allegedly, the entertainer declined. Hart then filed a temporary restraining order against Tasha Kay this month, claiming that the interview had damaged his reputation. Working in media outlets, my business depends to a great extent on my standing in the public's view of me. That perception is of particular concern given that I am involved in a number of projects that are focused on families, such as Fatherhood, Captain Underpants, The Secret Life of Pets, and the Jumanji franchise, The Filing States. However, his request has been denied at this time. Rolling Stone reports that Judge Mitchell L. Beckloff argued that Hart's request lacked crucial information that would have allowed him to grant the temporary restraining order. Beckloff stated, just a really vague, overbroad request that doesn't address actual malice, describing Hart's motion as, just a really vague, overbroad request that doesn't address actual malice. Part of the problem I have is that there are no direct quotes of what occurred in the hour and a half interview, Beckloff stated. Dante Mills, Hart's attorney, continued to argue with the judge without success. They are unquestionable. The speakers have said things that are against the law. He explained, it's extortion, defamation, and blatant malice on their part. Prior to this video, there had never been any claims that my client had committed a crime. That to me is significant. Adultery is one thing, but it is not against the law. How do you feel about the denial of Kevin Hart's request for a restraining order against Tasha Kay? What might be said about him blaming her for blackmail? This week, a judge ruled in favor of YouTube vlogger Tasha Kay, also known as Latasha Keb, in a legal dispute with comedian actor Kevin Hart. The decision relates to a meeting Keb directed with Hart's previous individual associate Misha Shakes, which Hart tried to have eliminated from Keb's compensation per view stage. Rolling Stone was able to obtain court documents that show that Hart submitted an emergency petition for a restraining order against Keb on January 19. Hart claimed that Keb's interview with Shakes contained statements of defamation and an invasion of privacy. This interview served as the basis for the petition. The judge questioned Hart's attorneys about the petition's lack of a transcript of the interview. Dante Mills, Hart's attorney, claimed that they had the transcript, but they decided not to give it to him because they were concerned about his privacy. Mills argued that including the transcript would violate Hart's privacy. Hart had previously filed a defamation, breach of contract, invasion of privacy, and extortion lawsuit against Keb and Shakes. The claim originated from Keb's supposed interest of $250,000 from Hart to forestall the meeting's delivery. Hart refused, and as a result, the interview was made public on Keb's pay-per-view website. In the meeting, Shakes made claims with respect to Hart's own life, including betrayal. Mills argued that the allegations were defamatory and demonstrated malice on the part of Keb and Shakes, despite the fact that adultery may be morally repugnant and not illegal. Judge Beckloff dismissed Plant's contentions and denied Hart's solicitation for an impermanent controlling request. Instead, he advised Hart's lawyers to file a separate motion to seal the transcript or to use the existing lawsuit against Keb and Shakes to get a preliminary injunction. Tasha Kay still has the right to post her interview with Misha Shakes, Kevin Hart's former assistant, online as a result of the ruling.